Hey guys, I'm Kyle, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to use Google Authenticator 2024. So let's get started. So first of all, what you want to do is to download your Google Authenticator from App Store or Play Store, and make sure that it's updated and you don't have the update button available on this app right here. So once you have made sure it's updated, you may now open the app. And from here, you can just log in with your Google account, and then you should be seeing your Google Authenticator, your codes right here. As you can see, mine, I have have quite a lot and from here to use Google Authenticator all you have to do is tap on the plus button on the bottom right of your screen so you would have two options either you could enter a setup key or scan a QR code so for example you are enabling your two-factor authentication in Binance then uh, Binance would provide you the setup key which is uh, this one right here the 16 digit key or the QR code right here that you can scan if you have your other device so yeah this is what you would need and you can now use either of these options in Google Authenticator. So that's how you do it. So let's say we want to go for enter a setup key right here and just uh, just input the account name or the code name. So let's say tutorial Binance code right here. And your key, you want to paste the 16 digit key that you have copied right here. And you can choose the type of key if you want to be, to be time based or counter based. I recommend uh, time based so that it would have a timer and uh, it would be very def difficult for other people to hack and so on. So you want to click on add once you're done. And then you would now have the code right here at the bottom. As you can see the tutorial Binance code. And now I want to go back into my Binance right here and I want to tap on next and then all I have to do is just provide the authenticator code right here and I just paste it paste that and submit and now there we have it we now have used Google Authenticator so that is basically how you use it and now you can use this code every time you log in into Binance or log in into another account and uh, uh, remember that you cannot only just use this on Binance this is basically for all of the other apps that you will be using Google Authenticator on and uh, you can also use the QR code right here if that app would provide you the QR code. So yeah, I think that is basically it on how you can use Google Authenticator. It is very simple. So I hope this video helped you out. Thank you for watching.